Oh, hi there, and welcome back to Minecraft. I'm here on the NH13 server, and as you can see, I'm standing in the iceberg base once again. Uh, but I'm getting a bit sick and tired of the way this looks with all the uh, all the rails, the bamboo, etc. So I think today's the day I'm going to actually try and clear this up and make this the way it should look. Um, so I'm going to do that real quick. So I'm going to get rid of all the rails, going to get rid of most of the bamboo. I might leave some of them there. Um, down this section, but certainly get rid of all the ones that are down there in the background, as you can see. Uh, they all have to go. Uh, so I'm going to get my farms back to the way they should be, and then we'll get on with the episode. Right, so that's the top floor done, and if anyone noticed in my previous video, I actually broke my sugarcane farm ever so slightly, so I fixed that as well. Got rid of all the bamboo in these ones. Uh, Oh, something's just gone through. Um, got rid of all the rails and the bamboo that was creeping up. So, I, but I have left. Well, I've left some of them, but obviously got rid of the majority of them. So this is looking a lot better up here. Um, next floor, I do need to do some more. Um, I think. Well, just to be honest, this was actually not that bad. The biggest problem here is the fact that I've let the this, Spencer's actually run out of shears, so I need to fill up all of those, and I do have a bunch of shears, and I have to just go in and just shear these all off just to get them started, uh, but the wool farm has sort of stopped working, so let me just stock them up, and then we'll get rid of all that stuff down there, and we can, we can move on with stuff. Water elevators are now being fixed up, so they go the right directions. Uh, sheep are now being sheared. Now to get rid of all this bamboo, this is going to be... Well, this is going to be a nightmare, to be honest, and uh, there's chickens as well. Um, lots and lots of chickens, so... These all need to go. Can you get out of my face? So this is probably going to cause some lag as well uh, with all these entities here. Uh, so I need to get rid of all of this and um, say it's just a matter of then getting the farms up and running. Um, I was planning to actually make some proper farms down here with villagers, but I never got around to it. Um, probably not going to do it yet. I think I'll just replace it the way it was. But um, yeah, I'll get this done. I'll be back in a moment. My inventory is completely full now and <laughs> there's still... Loads left. I don't even know how many chickens there are. Ridiculous amounts. And loads and loads of bamboo. So I need to find... I need to go store some of these away and then come back and then finish them off. But even just being here, they're, I mean, they're wandering around. They're just sorting. They're just making a mess. And there's obviously one escaped up here somewhere. Oh, I don't know. Uh, right, so let's have a look. If we put the bamboo in there... Getting quite a collection now of bamboo though, so that's good. That will come in handy. Uh, I've got some eggs to go in that one. Uh, I will find a use for these. I know exactly what I'm going to do with them, and it's going to involve going back to see the others at some point. Can you get out, uh, out, out, out? Chasing chickens all over the place. Oh, that's so annoying. That is so annoying. And they just, just, just get out of my face. Get out of my face, chickens. But once it's done, it's sorted. Because let's be honest, no one's going to come back and do the same prank again. So I think I can fix this up. And we should be right. Is that all the bamboo? No, not all yet. Okay, most of the bamboo is gone. Let's kill these few chickens and then... Yeah, yeah, no, that should be fine. So I'll get rid of all, I'll kill all these guys, get some space, get these all back. Uh, and I think, look at this, we have got lots and lots and lots of wool. So I'm thinking possibly, maybe either sell it or give it away really, either give it away for nothing or sell it for really cheap because it doesn't cost much to get. Um, and I know it's quite useful, so other people will probably find it useful as well, and I'm quite happy to obviously share what I've got with people so yeah once we sort this out I think we'll go look at building something over at spawn where we can sort of give these away for nice and cheap I generally thought that I'd found everything but apparently I needed to look outside um lot of snow missing and there's a chest oh that's a chest from Vane Oh, oh, okay, I need to make some space. Right, so I need to fix this up as well, because apparently that's a thing, and there's a creeper up there, so let's not kill the polar bear. Perfect, and please die, one, two, three, bosh. Yes, okay, so I need to fix this up, and collect this from bank. Well, like, be right back. Right, so we've got there, finished putting the snow around, and cleared some space so I can actually have a look at this. So, if you didn't watch the previous episode, 
you may not realize but i have joined a faction uh with vane uh i'm going to get a few other people involved as well i think lord master trot has joined and he's probably got one of these at his base uh but vane has been out and he's given um a little welcome box so let's just have a look at it so we've got the frost shield so now uh, we'll take it all out the frost shield we've got the frost banner or two frost banners and we've got frost knight helmet which we'll put on a second uh frost walker 2 that's going to be good for the boots and then a welcome note so let's have a quick read of that very quickly uh what does that say dear fellow frost mason the council is forever in your debt for choosing the correct and all-powerful faction we shall rise above our enemies with swift and tactical strategy hopefully these initiation gifts are sufficient enough as a thank you for joining us May the cold winds of the north be in your favour. V for vain. Now that is awesome. Now the first thing I want to do is actually decorate the base with the banner. So if I pop that there. Oh, whoops. And then we're going to need to actually get rid of this, unfortunately. Uh, and pop that there. So we are now set up as frost masons. Um, mm, I'd like to put... Let's put that, that, that can go there, that can be there. So we'll keep hold of this stuff and let's put the helmet on real quick. So, and a shield, I guess. Uh, where's my shield? Pop that in my looking cool. Looking very cool. Screenshot. I love it. I absolutely love it. Okay, so... That is awesome. Uh, we're gonna need to. Do, I need to spend some time with Vane and the others as well. We will be recruiting new members to the cause, uh, so we'll be working on that soon enough. Uh, but um, we do have plans for this episode, so we'll have to come back to that uh, and um, see how it develops. So heading over to spawn now. Finally, while I'm here, I just want to check on the repair shop because we did a little prank here around a few of the places as well and oh it looks like Kenneth's been online so he's obviously seen it interesting to see what will happen from there do you know I'm not this this shield I just don't like the way they, they cover <gasps> where's my eye scum I was gonna say I don't like the way they cover half the screen that's why I don't use them most of the time um, so they I'm guessing this is Kenneth uh, they've taken it one step further because I, oh my, the order of the concrete is will always win. Order of the concrete, great. So I'd set this up. Um, this is my fault, really, because I am. Um... <laughs> oh, no, I um, iced Kenneth Shops, and he's obviously come back. At... Oh, oh. Right, let's, we're going to make a mess with these. Let's um, Lots and lots of free food for me, though. That's good. Uh, I need to fix this up. This is ridiculous. Ha! I wasn't expecting that. Oh, where, he's, oh, they're all just escaping. Ah, 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 ah. I'd, I'd throw lava in there or something, but I don't want to lose all my stuff in there. Can you stop trying... Can, 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 Chuck, stop it. Stop it, chickens. Stop it. I can't believe they've done this. This is ridiculous. Let's make some space. I need to, I'm going to get some ice and rebuild it. Ah. Oh. So much for just making a new shop. What is all this? I can't read the signs. Blue concrete. Compre oh, okay. So they've kept the stuff in there, but they've renamed it all. Get... All this stuff away. Come on. Okay, so I've got, I've still got my stock. Oh, and I've actually got a sale as well. That's good. This is ridiculous. How long have these all been here? They've laid so many eggs. Oh. Okay, let me just let me sort these out. Just look at how much stuff is left after filling up my inventory. Just go to show how many chickens were in there. I don't think we we won't, don't want the feathers. Let's get rid of the feathers. Let's get the food and we get the eggs because I've got, actually I don't want the eggs. Get rid of them because I've got loads of eggs and I'm gonna definitely get my own back with this. I 
it's got to be Kenneth um, because I've iced his shops, so he's got to have done this. There's no two ways about that. I don't know if he was on his own, but he certainly did it. Um, although uh, I have um, I have recently been targeting a few other people, like obviously Cosmo and. Well, we won't go any further with that because you've not seen a video for it yet. Um, but yeah, he's. Um, I think I'm getting a few enemies on the server right now, and um, I think we're going to need to recoup the troops from our side because um well this is far from over i want all of the food give me give me give me give me give me give me there's just so many it just it's just taking me about 15 minutes to kill these all uh, i mean there's still loads of chickens everywhere i must have been causing so much lag before blue was just saying he was struggling with frames per second so i reckon he was around here and he's just struggling with with all the chickens um but yeah, let's um, let's tidy up. Let's get all the stuff we want and get rid of everything else we don't want. And then we'll actually get around to building what we wanted to build today. Right, well, I, I'm going to leave the concrete there for the time being. Just to make a statement, I will change it back to ice when I... Well, in a little bit. But for the time being, I'm going to let them just think that I've noticed it. And when they come a bit closer, they'll notice that it's open business and ice is nice, concrete is evil. Uh, I have already fixed up all the signs inside and uh, obviously put uh, all the right stuff in the right chest, etc, etc, and restocked. Um, but, um, yes, Kenneth, you, when you see this, you're not going to think... I, uh, you're going to think I haven't noticed, but I have. Uh, and I'll fix it at some point. Now, wool shop. I'm thinking a good location would be somewhere around here, just near the dye shop, um, because, you know, it's multicoloured. So I did bring a load of um, wool, which I've got in shulker boxes all over the place. I think that one's got some, and that one's got some, etc. Um, so, yeah, let me um, try and come up with a design, see how it's going to look. It's going to be pretty standard, pretty basic, nothing fancy, uh, just with a chest and some, I don't know what price we're going to charge yet, I'll figure that out and um, yeah, we'll see what it's like. So that's it finished, uh, where did you come from? I thought I'd killed all of you. Um, so it's not the prettiest things because um, well, I wanted to get people's attention so I thought I'd do a multicoloured tower and I'd make sure that it's blocking a lot of the view of Cosmo shops just because. And inside it's just got a couple of chests, I need to stock it up, I've got, though this so far these are all full stacks of uh, wool, uh, but as you can see, I'm looking at charging any colour wool three stacks for one diamond. Uh, it seems it might still be a little bit too expensive. I'm not really sure. I mean, it doesn't cost a great deal. Ha 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 ha! Cosmo fell from a high place. Love it. <laughs> Um, yes, it may not cost a lot to actually make this, but I do use, obviously, need, it's a lot of iron, or a fair bit of iron every now and then for shears, so I've got to charge something. Hopefully that's something people appeal to. If not, then I'll just surprise. But I'm going to go back and just get as much uh, wool as possible and stock it up, because um, someone can use it. If if I'm not going to use it, someone else might not do Someone else might do. Uh, but let's just do that. And Vane and Cosmo, as you can see, are both online now, so I may be need to catch up with them and just see what they've been doing. Vane, hello, how are you? Geeky, hello. I'm all right, mate, how are you? Very well, thank you for my gift. I had a look at it a bit earlier, and well, obviously, as you can see, I am wearing my gear. Uh, yep. Banners are all set up at my base, looking pretty cool. Uh, and I see you've got yours here, obviously. I've, that came out in my last video. Um, but I thought I'd just have a quick catch up with you, because we've not physically spoken properly about the Frost Masons. And... Um, well, the guys of the concrete firm, they're getting a little bit bolshy and we need to put take Yeah, it down they're a bit out of hand, yeah. Yeah. So, so what what have they done since since you last retaliated? Right, so um oh, loads of things. I think they've gone back and put loads of chickens all over my base inside the bamboo, which I fixed now. So that's all sorted. Um and also my shop at Spawn, which as you know used to look like Ice it has been replaced yeah. with concrete. Okay. And they filled it with chicken. <laughs> Absolutely filled it. So I've got loads and have some chicken. Have have some chicken as a as a gift from me to you. As all right. Thank you very much. So, Vane, while we're here, I know you've been working on a secret area, and um, yeah, I don't want to show people the way in, but so we'll cut that out. But shall we go head over okay, to sure. that somewhere miles and miles yeah. away from here? <laughs> yeah. So, um, 
I can talk about this bit. So this is going to be a sort of a front for our base. Okay. But, Let me get rid of this um, so it's meant to look all built up and cool, but actually we're going to be living somewhere else. So, um, okay. I've been working on a little bit of something outside of the ship. Oh, wow. So this we've got, I've good. got, this is probably uh, temporary, this. Yeah, okay. What is it called? Conduit. Yeah. Yeah, just to keep us alive while we are down here. Um, but if you come across the bridge, which you don't really need to, but... So oh, the yeah. law here would be that this is um, where the Frost Masons used to reside, but then it eventually sank okay. and they fled into this iceberg. Now, there's nothing inside here currently. Oh, well, that was a secret there's door. A, there's right. a lever down here. That's cool. Which I'll probably... I've noticed that actually the Concrete Boys do have key cards, so I'm going to have to sort that out. Yes, but, we need to make sure that... Because they will figure out where this is, and we need to make sure they can't find their way in. Exactly, exactly. So... Um, this this is the plan. So this if we get something your... sorted down here, okay, that's cool. Um, we can collaborate on that. And also, we did both mention building the we've got time for today so if you liked the video and enjoyed it please give it a big like and a thumbs up if you haven't already please consider subscribing to the channel and obviously tell your friends about it too because if you like it there's a good chance they will too but as always i've been skiki gamer he's been vain you've been awesome and thanks for watching goodbye you can say goodbye goodbye <laughs> <laughs> bye